Hello guys and welcome back to tutorial number one of my new tutorial season. Today I will show you how to set up MCP for Minecraft with a version 1 power 6, 7 and above. So, the guys uh, that have uh, programmed uh, models for 1, 2, 5 and on, remember it's uh, very complicated to set up MCP. Well, this has a change with the change to one to uh, one power a six. All we need now is forge. So we go to the forge page. Go to the releases. main do forge downloads and now we have recommended and latest and universal and source for both. For this tutorial I will also use the latest version and for this tutorial we need source. Universal will not work, we need the source version. So here we go. So for this tutorial I will create a new folder on my desktop and call it Forge. So yeah, forget you know. Uh, Forge. So, we now take our the just downloaded file and move it to this folder. After we have moved it, we unpack it. Take some seconds and we will get another folder called Forge. Can delete the zip file now. We go inside this folder and there you will find a file called install.cmd. This install.cmd we start. And now lay back, relax, drink a cup of coffee. This could take a while. As you can see, there's downloading stuff, extracting, and so on and so on. While the system is running, we will do some other thing. We will download the second component, component we need. So, we go to the Flans page. And on this page, in the Minecraft form, you will find some way down here, where is it? Here, the modeling helper 2.0 for Flans mod. 2.0 for Minecraft 1 power 6. It also runs well for 1 power 7. So we download it. 60 kilobytes. And we also move this file to the Forge folder. And as you see, it's still working and working and working.
So, that's it. We can now close this window. And if you look inside, there's a Forge folder we unpacked. You now see a folder called MCP. If you open it, you will see exactly the same files you know from MCP before. We have a decompile, recompile, start client, and so on and so on. So, to test it, we will recompile. And start client. Again, you see Forge is doing some stuff, downloading, and Minecraft is running. Creating a new world to have a look. So, here we go. Minecraft and the fourth Forge version is running. So we can close it now. Closing this window. Now we have to apply the modeling helper, which is quite easy. We unpack it. If you unpack it, you will get a folder called a CO, and this CO we move to MCP SRC. Minecraft. Inside this folder you will find the UK folder, plants mod folder, client common, and inside the client you will find a mold models, and here we go. Here we have now all the models from Flan. Here we have the turbo model thingy or nitro model thingy meanwhile. And inside the common folder you find the modeling helper. To check the MCP with a Flans flying mod and the modeling helper, we will now enable one model. So we go to the common modeling helper folder and there you will find mod modeling helper Java. Basically it's the same file we used before in 125. We open it and here we go. There's a difference between the 125 and 146 and above versions. In 125 you only need one entry in this file. In 146 and above you need two. So the first you will notice here this gray area and down here there's also a gray area. This area is commented, so it's not used as a code, it's just as a text with this double slash or this slash and a star. All between the slashes and a slash and star is only text. So I will use the Lancaster for testing. I will take the import mod model Lancaster and move it up here. So outside these slash a star and it changed the color so it's now active as code. The same thing we do up here in the register model section. Here we do also move it up outside the brackets and now it's also colored. Up here the model is imported inside this file. And down here this is for registering the model inside the game and to register the skin file. So in front of we have the model and here we have the skin file belonging to the model. So we save it, can close it now and basically we can start now for checking but well we will not because if we do it now, the Lancaster is created without skin, so it's invisible. So we have to copy the skin 
to the skin folder. So where's the skin folder? Well, it's not here now. So we go to bin, Minecraft, and here in this folder we create a new folder called skins. And well, I'm looking now where we have it. Let's back up. Skins, Lancaster, here we go. And we copy now the skin folder of the Lancaster inside this created folder in bin Minecraft skins. So let's go back. Say recompile. The recompiling is now creating the Java files for us. Here we go. If you find, uh, get the, can't find the server sources, try decompiling. Well, it's making no difference. So you can do it, you can don't do it, I don't do it. And after recompiling, we use a start client. Here we go. Single play inside the world. And checking if the model is running. So for checking the model, we need the model viewer. For the model viewer, we open the inventory and go to the miscellaneous tab. And down here, we find the model viewer. It looks like flint and steel. So, and if we click here, it's inside the game, we have our Lancaster bomber. If you don't copy the skin file to this folder, well, uh, then this model is invisible. It's there, but it's invisible. So, as you see, the Lancaster is here, and all is running well, so that's it. You are MCP is running and waiting for your models. If you create own models, you just simply put the source file you created inside the source Minecraft CO UK Flans Mod Client Model folder. Yeah, I know it's long. MCP SRC Minecraft CO UK Flans Mod Client Model. You place them here and have to register them in the modeling helper as we registered the Lancaster before. Then you run MCP with, with uh, these recompile and start client.